My question is to the Minister of Health and reads as follows. What options is Te Whatu Ora considering for the repurposing or alternative use of the more than 17 million 839,000 rapid antigen tests, rats, that as of 12 June had either expired or will not be dispatched because they are nearing expiry? And what does it cost to Fatu Ora each month to store these expired or expiring rats? In answer to the first part of the question, I am advised to Fatu Ora are considering a range of op options to mitigate product waste through expiry date extensions and deferring orders where possible. In answer to the second part of the question, I am advised that Te Whatuora does not have specific information on the warehousing costs of the expired component of the stock holding. Oh, supplementary. Where are the rapid antigen tests being stored and by which organisations? Te Whatuora has stored the rapid antigen tests in a warehouse that they have contracted. I'm happy to give the member of uh, the name of the supplier if they put it on notice. Who owns it and how much are they spending on the contract? Uh, Mr Speaker, I'm happy to provide the uh, cost of the cost of the warehousing overall for the member if the member puts that question on notice. Is she seriously saying she cannot answer how much they're spending on storage of the expired or expiring rat tests and does not know where they are being stored or by whom? Uh, no, Mr Speaker. I am saying that Te Whatu Ora is, does not have specific information on the warehousing costs of the expired component of the stockholding. 